Okay, to install the OpenSnitch application firewall in Raspberry Pi Desktop OS, start by opening a web browser and going to github.com slash evil socket slash OpenSnitch slash releases. Okay, then scroll down. Until you find latest. And we're going to have two downloads. The first one is under daemon. And we're going to download deb x86 underscore 64. And if you have a real Raspberry Pi, you'll download the deb arm 64. So right click, save link as, save it to downloads, and scroll down and under GUI, we're going to download the dev file, right click, save link as, and save it to downloads. When you have those downloaded, close this window, go to the file browser, downloads folder, and right click on the one that starts with open snitch. Click package install. Click install. Enter your password. Okay, when that's done, right click on the file that starts with Python 3 and choose package install. Then click install. Enter your password. Okay, when both files have been downloaded, you can close the file manager, open a terminal, and type sudo systemctl enable open snitch. And then type sudo systemctl status open snitch. And it should say active running. Next, go to the menu, go to system tools, and click open snitch. And you should see the cloud icon on the right side of the upper taskbar. And you can click on that. And we'll get the main window. And it looks like we have our first warning. This is actually for my web browser or the, my DNS server and you've only got 15 seconds by default to make a decision so I'll just allow it here and it's allowed until restart 
So click the, that center icon there in the upper left. Take us to Preferences. And we're going to change the default timeout. I'm going to make it 60, so I have a longer amount of time to make my decisions. Then click Apply, and then Save. Okay, under Rules. can right click the role that we just enabled and click edit and I'm going to change it to allow always then click apply you should see rule applied, and then you can click close. So let's try opening a web browser. And it's asking us if Chromium can be allowed to access the internet. So instead of until reboot, I'm going to allow it forever. And then click allow. And that's how to use OpenSnitch application firewall. That's all there is to it. Thanks for watching.